Hi again. Since my last um, Carbot Sale Finds video, um, I've been to four. One was like a village garage sale where you go around and look at the people's stalls outside their houses, walk around the village and see what you can find. I'll start with what I've got from there. I've got this Philips Sensio coffee maker. That was £3. I got this Philips um, clock radio dock with instructions. It looks as new. That was three pound fifty. They are around fifteen pounds on eBay. Uh, what else did I get from there? I got um, our oh, uh, Wii steering wheel. That's just to add with a bundle. I have a I have a Wii. I'm gonna sell, so I was just gonna add that with a bundle. I also got um, that there. The Millennium Classical Masters, that was just a pound twenty CDs. So I got that. I got this um, Sony Sony Walkman boxed. It's a shame the um, bit that keeps the batteries in. Two little tabs have broke, so it doesn't hold shut. But instructions and everything are in there, and that was t just twenty pence. All the stuff was from the garage sale things. So. Um, the best find from there for these boots. I'm not actually quite sure how you pronounce the, the name, but I know they're a good make, and they're the Gore-Tex also, and they're in good condition. A bit mud, mud on them, but they're really in good condition. They were just a pound. I think they were my find of the weekend. Really, I think they'll do well. And also the last thing. And here I think what I got from there was I got a load of leap pad stuff. There, there's lots of Batman, the maths, loads of the cartridges and the, and the books, Cat in the Hat, Toy Story 2, Incredibles, and also, also some more over here. And there's an, another leap pad in the in the bag so the whole lot of that stuff was five pounds so I sh think that should do okay. Uh, I think that is all the stuff from the garage sale lot. Oh apart from the etch sketch it's got the instructions stuck on the back. I think it's an original old one but that was also just a pound. And now we're moving on to stuff I found from car boot sales. These four mugs um, there's a Forever Friends, Simpsons, Star Trek and Baileys, all of them for were 80p. Simpsons tie, I think that was a pound. Could be a bit too much for that really, but we shall see. I bought a Kenwood kettle, cordless kettle. Um, it, it, it's a bit scaling, it's a D scale, but that was just two pounds. I find that sort of stuff does okay. I got a Logitech, I think it is, um, dock. It doesn't charge your iPhone. It, the iPhone will fit on and, and play through it, but it doesn't charge it. But that was in a case with the remote and everything and plug and everything for two pound fifty. So we'll have a go and see how good that does. I got this Technics um, CD player that comes with lots of um, in-car charger, um, mains lead, instructions. A few other bits and pieces. Headphones have never been used as well, and that that works works fine. And that was two pound fifty. Uh, what else have we got? Um, I've been trying to shy away from games lately, but I thought the Buckaroo Toy Story Three was quite a good one, and the condition was good, so I paid a pound for that. The Murder Mystery Dinner Party game that is brand new and sealed for. And that was a pound. And the guess who is sealed brand new. And that was one pound fifty. So I'll hang on to them till Christmas probably. Might try and forget like a free listing or something. But I'm not worried of hang on to them till Christmas. And oh yeah, there was that Lexmark ink. That's just fifty P, so never done a lot with the ink. It's the first one I've bought. I'm not really quite sure what's good or not, but I thought that was worth a go for 50p. 
Yeah, I've got these three Nintendo um, Game Boy Advance games. I've already had the Shrek one, so I'm going to bundle that with the Simpsons Road Rage and Harry Potter Chamber of Secrets. So I'll put them together. Now I'll move on to the shoes, trainers. Um, some Adidas trainers there. Good condition. They were a pound. Need a bit of a clean up on the front, but they were just a pound. I thought I'd show you the boots. Um, there was them, diesel, like flower or floral effect. Quite a nice pair of shoes, I thought. Can't really find much information about them, but you know, I think they're quite unusual. So, I'll see what, how good they will do. I've got these um, high tech, they're brand, they're brand new, I think. The soles are really, really good. Don't know if they've been worn to me. They were two pound a pair. I've got some Converse. They're quite worn, but they will clean up okay. They were just a pound. Got some Nike there. They just need a clean up. I think they're all okay. They're not in too bad condition. They were a pound. And some ladies' sketches. And they're in good condition. They're like pink effect on the suede so they were two pound and also some large adidas they are larger 13 and a half but i thought you know so i might be looking looking for something like that and they cost me three pound so this is um part one i'll be along with part two soon also um Last weekend, I think it was, I bought a Sky HD box, which sold, which you'll see just after this video in my sales. That cost me £3. And the Breville One Cup, that cost me £3 as well. So I did alright with them, they sold pretty quick. Had a few other sales, but I find it's really sort of slowed down at the moment. I don't know why that would be, but we'll just wait and see how things go. But I'll be along with part two probably the next few days. So thanks for watching.